Disconnect the AC power adapter from the computer. Press the power button. Then, repeatedly press the F1 key until the BIOS appears. Use the right arrow key to select the configuration menu. Use the down arrow key to select power and press enter. Then, select disable built-in battery and press enter. Confirm that yes is selected and press enter to power down the system. Insert a straightened paper clip into the release hole of the SIM card tray. Pull the tray from the slot and leave it out until servicing is complete. Place a plastic pry tool into each of the two notches located near the front edge of the keyboard frame. Carefully slide the frame forward about two and a half millimeters to reveal the screws. Make sure no keys are blocking the frame's movement. Carefully loosen the six captive screws securing the keyboard to the chassis. Make sure not to damage or dislodge the keys. The screws are located next to the following keys. The semicolon key, the J key, the F key, the S key, the up arrow key, and the control key. Lift the front edge of the keyboard, then lift the rear edge to expose the cables. Disconnect both cables from the system board. Connect both keyboard cables to the system board. Insert the rear edge of the keyboard under the corresponding edge of the bezel assembly. Carefully press down to snap the keyboard into place. Slide the keyboard toward the front, making sure the tabs are securely under the bezel. Carefully tighten the six captive screws to secure the keyboard to the system. Make sure not to damage or dislodge the keys. The screws are located next to the following keys. The control key, the S key, the F key, the J key, the semicolon key, and the up arrow key. Place a plastic pry tool into each of the two notches located near the front edge of the keyboard frame. Carefully slide the frame toward the front of the system. Insert the SIM card under the tab in the SIM card tray. Insert the tray into the slot until it clicks into place. Connect the power supply cable to the computer. Press the power button to automatically enable the battery.